Asante sana mwanahabari wetu Ridwan Juma kwa taarifa yako safi kabisa. Lakini mtazamaji tunasalia tu pale pale hotelini ambapo mwanahabari wetu Charles Somondi ameweza kuzuru moja wapo ya hizi hoteli na natueleza kwamba zingali zinaendelea kutoa chanjo kwa wafanyikazi wake dhidi ya corona. Hii ni hatua ambayo inaendelea kuzua wasiwasi ikilinganishwa na idadi ya watu ambao wahudumu hawa hutangamana nao kila siku katika kazi zao. Hebu tuweze kupata taarifa yake ili tujue ni yapi anayoendelea kule. Taifa la Kenya imebahatika kutoa dozi milioni moja nukta saba kwa wananchi wapatao sabini ambayo ni asilimia moja nukta tatu kwa wote ambao wamepokea chanjo hiyo. Idadi hii inajumuisha walengwa kama vile wafanyikazi katika sekta ya utalii, walimu na maafisa wa usalama. Hoteli nyingi hapa pwani ingali kuafikia asilimia moja ya chanjo dhidi ya virusi vya corona licha ya serikali kuipa idara hiyo kipaumbele katika utoaji wa chanjo hiyo baadhi ya wafanyikazi katika sekta hiyo wangali kupokea awamu ya pili ya chanjo. Haya yanabainika siku chache baada ya Uingereza kutoa chanjo 1410 aina ya AstraZeneca kupitia uwanja wa kimataifa wa ndege JKIA Julai mwakani. Kwa mfano hoteli ya kifahari ya Nyali Reef imebahatika kuwapo wafanyikazi 30 kati ya 60 chanjo dhidi ya virusi hivyo na kama anavyotuarifu afisa wa idara ya usalama Jora Mgao vita dhidi ya janga la COVID-19 ingali kutatuliwa vilivyo because each and every day we find that uh, we get the information from the Ministry of Health cases are bad so you see now it affects the business whenever they brings uh, issues about this covid-19 now we still expect like uh, not a number of cases so we can't have more much much manpower now we normally vary we see how many clients we have for booking so that we can know exactly which manpower can take in the clients that are coming so uh, basically most of them are still being laid off Aidha hoteli hiyo imekiri kupokea usaidizi kutoka Wizara ya Afya baada ya wizara hiyo kuwapa vifaa pamoja na mafunzo ya kujikinga dhidi ya virusi hivyo. Uh, we have been helped through the Ministry of Health that we've already vaccinated like let's say half of our staff. They have received uh, the second doses of AstraZeneca and still the procedure is still ongoing. So in the meantime all our outlets starting from the main entrance all the way to all the outlets that we have uh, everything is put in place uh, regarding safety issues Hatua inayochukuliwa na serikali kuhusu utoaji wa chanjo inatia wasiwasi wapo serikali iko tayari kufungua uchumi kikamilifu Kazi yetu kidogo mapato yamekuwa chini na ni kwa msimu huu tangu mwaka jana tuseme mpaka kufikia sasa e, changamoto hizo kwa kweli zimekuwa zikituathiri katika biashara yetu. Biashara inapokuwa iko chini wale mapato unayopata inakuwa ni matumizi na kuwa tena kuwekeza katika mali inakuwa tena ni vigumu. Nikiripotia Boss TV